Behind these boarded up windows, total destruction. The first thing that hits you is the smell. <coughs> Enough to make our photojournalist nose burn. Inside, we saw a broken TV, smashed windows, furniture flipped over, and holes in the wall. All the fumes is embedded into the wall, the beds, the couches, clothes, everything. So we have to throw everything away. Crystal Brown lives here with her husband and seven young kids. She says they were left homeless Wednesday when a SWAT team raided their place. Deputies were searching for four men accused of robbing a pawn shop at gunpoint and arrested two of them hiding on Brown's property. Behind the house, the windows are boarded up and on the ground, evidence of that alleged robbery. You can see here a uh, watch holder and here uh, cases for rings, evidence still left behind. Brown didn't know the suspects, but is now suffering the consequences. These people have been, they're, they're basically in a homeless situation by no fault of their own. I feel sad that we don't have our house. The Orange County Sheriff's Office tells us, though the agency is not liable, we wanted to and did help the family by putting them up in a hotel for the night and offering five more days if the family agreed to sign a release, which the family says would have absolved the Sheriff's Office of any financial responsibility, which they refused. With no insurance and nowhere to go, this family of nine now forced to find somewhere to stay. No shoes, no beds, no furniture, no food. In Orange County, Matt Grant, West 2 News.